Germany, a Shining World Leadership Award for Compassion and a Shining World Caring Leadership Award laureate, supports food security in Mali. Germany's Federal Ministry for Economic Cooperation and Development has donated 11 million euros to the United Nations World Food Programme to help the people of Mali respond to challenges from conflict, climate events and COVID-19. Germany has an ongoing commitment to the Sahel region and the latest donation will assist 144,000 people across Mali with nutritional aid, including an estimated 43,500 children as well as expectant and nursing mothers. In addition, 86,000 individuals will be the recipients of cash transfers to help them develop assets and food will be provided to 15,100 students. Our gratitude, Germany, and God's blessings for your sustained support to Mali. Thank you also, United Nations World Food Programme, for your unwavering assistance to those in need. In heaven's grace, may we lift each other up and advance together for a world of prosperity and harmony. Portugal, a Shining World Leadership Award for Compassion recipient to accept unaccompanied refugee children from Greece. Portugal's Minister of Foreign Affairs, his Excellency Augusto Santos Silva has announced that the country will accept 500 minors from Greek refugee camps as soon as travel restrictions due to the coronavirus crisis are eased. It is part of a European voluntary plan to find homes for 1,600 of the reported 5,200 unaccompanied youngsters currently residing in Greece. Other countries involved in the program include Luxembourg, which has welcomed 12 children, Germany, which has received about 50 youngsters, Ireland and France. Many heartfelt thanks and a loving salute, Your Excellency Augusto Santos Silva, Portugal, Greece, Ireland, Luxembourg, France and Germany for your benevolent actions for the migrant children. Heaven bless you. We pray that all brave and courageous refugees of the world will soon find comfortable accommodation where they can live productively in dignity and peace, in celestial oneness. Israel plans to boost solar energy production. Israeli Minister of Energy, His Excellency Dr. Yuval Steinitz, announced that the government will invest 22.8 billion US dollars in solar power and phase out coal production by 2026. To meet the country's rising energy demand, a goal has been set to increase solar power from the current 5% to 30%, or about 16,000 megawatts by 2030, which will reduce air pollution by 93% compared to 2015 levels. Solar energy will provide 80% of the country's electricity during peak sunlight hours and at times more than 100% with the extra power being stored in batteries. The majority of the funding will be distributed across private sectors to build additional solar facilities, create improved energy storage systems and upgrade national energy infrastructure to support the clean energy expansion. Kudos Israel for fast-tracking green energy development. In divine light, let's foster a beautiful, sustainable and nourishing vegan world for all beings to flourish. Corals create sunscreen to adapt to warming waters. Researchers at the University of Southampton's Coral Reef Laboratory in the United Kingdom have noted that corals around the world have been making their own sunscreen to survive brief, mild bleaching events due to global warming. Instead of turning white as many corals do during bleaching, some corals turn themselves a bright color when their symbiotic partner, algae, leaves due to warm temperatures. This color pigment helps to protect the coral from sunlight and also attracts the algae back so the two can continue their lives together. In a healthy state, the coral is provided energy via photosynthesis from the algae that lives inside it and the algae receive nutrients, carbon dioxide and shelter. Thank you University of Southampton's Coral Reef Laboratory researchers for highlighting the good news about the coral's innate intelligence. We pray that soon the global climate will stabilize for the health and security of all beings. Children in India feed animals during coronavirus lockdown. Kind students in Dehradun, Uttarakhand province, some from low-income families, have been consolidating their pocket money to purchase food for animals, such as dogs, cats, birds and cows, whose food sources vanished during the lockdown due to the closure of restaurants and food vendors. The Uttarakhand Forest Department is also contributing funds and transportation for animals requiring medical assistance. 
After giving urgently needed food and water to a dog and a cow, Class 9 student Nisha Tapa said, They are my friends now. We should take care of these beings who cannot speak for themselves. Praising the children, the Forest Department's rescue team leader Ravi Joshi said, I wish we grown-ups too have such an empathy with pure heart. Divine blessings, youth of Dehadrin and the Otarkan State Forest Department, for your vital care of precious animals. May we all extend a caring and helpful hand to all our vulnerable co-inhabitants in heavenly goodness. Australian food company sees huge interest in vegan meats. Integrity Food Company, a contract food and supplement manufacturer in Queensland, Australia, recently released a plant-based minced meat after receiving orders for almost 10 times the amount they had expected from their partners. Initially, the company was going to produce a 5,000 unit trial of their new product, but after speaking to their distributors, they increased the batch to 45,000. The new vegan meat product is soy and gluten-free and is sold under the company's plant-based brand, Flexible Foods. The vegan mince is shelf-stable and dry, and can be cooked after rehydrating it in water. Hooray and congratulations Integrity Food Company on the successful launch of your plant-based mince. May your orders continue to exceed expectations as veganism grows around the world in God's delight. Adopted cat saves human companion's life. Bear, a feline adopted in December 2018 from the Lake Humane Society in Ohio, United States, repaid the favor by saving the life of Alan, her human friend. Alan was not feeling well one day, so he took a nap. But Bear sensed something was not right. She licked him and nudged him with her paws until he woke up. Upon awakening and experiencing vision problems and dizziness, Alan called an ambulance and went to the hospital. The doctors discovered that his blood sugar level was 900, and without Bear's intervention, Alan would have likely passed away in his sleep. Beautiful Bear, we are so amazed and touched by your heroic act. Heaven bless you. May you and Alan have many loving, healthy and joyous years together. Supreme Master Ching Hai happily present the Shining World Hero Award to Bear plus 2,000 US dollars for vegan goodies with all love, kitty praises and gratitude. May God always protect you both in the forever love of the divine.